Go to your favorite browser and type download WordPress in the search bar, then hit enter. Click on the first link, which is the official WordPress website. Click the download WordPress button to start the download. If you want to download another server, such as LAMP, WAMP, MAMP or any other server, you can do so from their respective websites. For XAMPP server, go to the first link and click on Download XAMPP. Choose the latest version of XAMPP server for Windows, or a compatible version for your operating system. Click the Download 64-bit button to download the XAMPP server for Windows. If the server download does not start automatically, click the Click Here button to download the XAMPP server. Wait for the download to finish. Click on the downloaded XAMPP server file to start the installation process. Click OK and then Next. Follow the installation prompts by clicking Next until the installation is complete. This may take several minutes. Start both Apache and MySQL services by clicking the Start button in the XAMPP control panel. Go to your download folder where you saved the WordPress setup, and copy the setup file. Open your local disk C, then the XAMPP folder, then the docs folder, and paste the WordPress setup file here. Extract the setup file and wait for the extraction to finish. Open your browser and type localhost slash WordPress or your WordPress folder name, then hit enter. Choose your language and click continue. Click, let's go. Create a database by opening a new tab and typing localhost slash mydmin in the address bar. Click New, then choose a name for your database.
Return to the WordPress installation setup and enter the database name you created in before. The default database username is root and the password field is empty, so leave it blank. Click Submit. Click Run the installation. Set up your basic information for your website, including the site title, username, password, and email address. If you use the default password, save it somewhere safe. If you choose to use your own password, type it in and check the box to confirm the use of a weak password. Click Install WordPress. Your WordPress installation is now complete. Click the Login button to log into your WordPress website. Enter your username and password to log in. To access your WordPress dashboard, open a new tab and type localhost slash WordPress slash WP admin or localhost slash WordPress slash WP login .php in the address bar. Click Visit Site to view your default WordPress website. Congratulations, you have successfully installed WordPress and can now start customizing your website. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you for watching.